So look, this is one of my favorite 40k threads. I don't know why it's taken me so long to actually start doing this one. Um, it's great. If you haven't read it before, I definitely recommend it. I'm going to be cutting this up into multiple parts because it's a massive thread. So look, I hope you guys enjoyed and let's just get into it, will we? Be Imperial Guard. Be training in the base with my small squad of 2 million men. After 2 weeks of playing tag and hot potato we finally get our equipment. Flak armor and a bitchin laser gun. Fuck yeah JPEG. Next day get woken up at like 4am by General Dickface. He orders us to regroup with a bunch of other guys near the landing pods. Apparently we're getting sent to a campaign. We're fighting some Roberts or some shit. Like the General is giving a fuck about briefings. We get an hour drop ships and lift off. Everybody is sleeping, as we got basically torn from our sleep. I never seen a Laskan in action so I'm excited as fuck. Start fidgeting with my Laskan. Pull the trigger by accident. Shot some guy in the face. He just scratched his nose. Didn't even wake up. What the fuck dot png. Land on some shitty snow planet. Upon arrival the commissar that's supposed to babysit us gives us some more details. He says we're fighting some ancient, green terminators that want to eradicate humanity. Lol what? He then pulls out his gun and shoots a random guy in the face. Hey, whatever he was a fag anyway. Always cheating in hide and seek during advanced combat training. Commissar continues his spiel about dying in the name of the Emperor and death before dishonor. What use? I'm just waiting to meet those necrofags. See what all the fuss is about. Pull the trigger by accident. Shot some guy in the face. He just scratched his nose. Didn't even wake up. The safety is on you. Dense fuck at normal power of full fledged Laskan blows unprotected limbs clean off. To prevent morons fiddling with their last gun angering its machine spirit into an accidental discharge, we've included a safety switch on all last gun models. Until such time it is armed with the incantation awakeno spirit. For enemies of mankind await in the proper setting of the switch into an armed position, your last gun's machine spirit slumbers. See also. He then pulls out his gun and shoots a random guy in the face. Ask either him or your regimental engineer for instructions. Goddamn it you faggots are the reason I have combat servitors as bodyguards. Lobotomy seems to raise the average guardsman IQ by 10. Be necrofag. Hanging around tomb world. Taking a quick 5000 year nap. Asshole tomb lord wakes me up. Too tired for this shit JPEG. Those weird ass fleshy fucks are back. Just wonderful. Get up and start killing. They die easily. I do too. But I get back up again. Love the look on their face when I do that. Priceless. The fleshy fucks have those weird flashlights. Hate those things. Not because they hurt they don't but because the flesh fetishist flayed ones get really talkative. Oh it's so bad for my skin. Really dries out my skin. Oh look here's some more skin. I don't care about your damn skin Steve. Try and stay away from them. Oh wonderful. They have one of those weird red ones. Someone told me about them. Apparently, they are the fleshy fucks versions of the flayed ones. They get really into the whole metal thing. Try and stay away from them. They always look at me really creepily. Like I'm some sort of sex toy. Be commissar. Have to babysit some new fag guards men's and brief them on what the fuck necron fags are because the noble leading their regiment was high on some warp dust. I swear to the emperor that one of these new fag guardsmen asked why don't we just try to hack them for imperial use. Fucking new fags dot voxcast. Ended up shooting him for heretical thinking. Later realized during the battle that the regimental leader neglected to teach these new fags that their fucking LAS guns have power settings meaning they attempted to shoot what are essentially flash. Lights on the lowest possible settings. Ended up having to execute one stroke eighth of these new fags for attempting to flee while teaching the others how god get their flashlight to a higher setting. The battle was so one sided the necron lord fag let us retreat due how amusing and sad it was for him. Fuck heresy. Only positive outcome of this whole battle was that it gave me an excuse to ballam the noble regimental leader for incompetence. Got to be the leader of a new fag guardsman army. Be Ordo Xenos Inquisitor. Find evidence of Necron Tomb Complex on an outlier world. Should probably handle it but the local system gov is throwing a bull and his niece is pretty hot. Browbeat general fuck face into action and sick him on it. Man I hope he doesn't fuck this up. That dickhead inquisitor Carolus will never let me hear the end of it if I have to requisition another stormtrooper regiment. Be catagen. Get sent to a death world that's been taking the Cadian boys months to clear out. Our debrief says the plant itself has been giving the guard more problems than the heretics. Read the planet report. Me and the boys are amazed this planet is even considered a death world. Show me a warface.png. 
After Valkyrie lands me and boys go into the jungle ASAP, the planet itself was a like a kindergarten compared to what me and boys are used to. We find the main heretic camp in a day and destroy it. This little incursion turned out to be the best weekend out company ever had. I am seriously tired of Segmentus Command sending non catachan regiments to jungle death worlds. Do not get me started on the time we got sent to a fracanized planet. B System Governor. Receive intel from Sim Inquisitor that some Necron fags are in the system. Hey Governor Anna, why don't you allow me and the Inquisition to deal with this problem? Start realizing this could mean potential exterminators. Don't worry about that Inquisitor Anna. Just let me get a local regiment and have them deal with it. Inquisitor seems hesitant though he agrees after I get my whore of a daughter to seduce him. Have some train regiment of some peasant fags we were able to get after Inquisitor Browby to general. Thing go fucking horribly wrong when the campaign starts. My face when my son was balanced for incompetence and entire regiment goes under the command of a commissar. My face when commissar requests inquisitorial stormtroopers to deal with the mess. What do I do peace and fags? The inquisition is going to be on my ass for this. Governor's ball went great. Planetary assault did not go so great. Ordered a few disappearances. Sent a letter of condolence to the governor for his son. Pinned the whole thing on those admech perfs. Never trust those freaks around the crons. Inquisitor Carolus just sent me an astropathis message. Probably gloating. The fuck. Doesn't matter. Had sex. Commissar. Get contacted by some other rando inquisitor stating the guy who let the assault happens is planning on making me disappear. Fucking heretics. Walk. Have one of the margos do some science fuckery to get one of the new fags to look like me for decoy purposes. Have to hide with a few arch margos when the governor sends his assassins. Get contacted by same inquisitor who contacted me gave me some dirt on the governor. Best detail being he used seduction to get the assault approved. Contact some lady I knew back in Scholar Progenium with this seduction info and tell her the governor is a slanishy heretic. A few weeks later, multiple sisters enter into the system and start a crusade. Was able to get my name cleared as I watched the sector be doused in cleansing fire. Also to the inquisitor who approved of this, I hope you get assigned to a world attacked by nids. Be servo skull. Wikachuk. Be sororitas. Canonist of the order of the ermine mantle. Don't get a fifth of the budget as bottle blonde martyred lady sluts do. Spend three years of your life fighting orcs over some bumfuck system. Bionic eye now because why wear a helmet when your hair is fucking fabulous but the emperor's protection decided to take a day off. Looking forward to going back to the shrine world. Get diverted because another local governor has gone heretic and it was on the way. Fucking fine. It's Slanesh too. You just know they're gonna be the rappy ones. Break out the flamers. Hopefully this doesn't take long. Be Slanishy heretic. Suddenly the governor is a heretic now too. Call bullshit he never comes to the Kokiji like everyone else. Start votes to kick him out. Everyone agrees. Next day sororitas show up and start torching people. We didn't even do anything for once it isn't our fault something bad happened. Get roasted by some Gina bimbo while balls deep in a shredder. Turns out this was all scene Tetch's fault. Fucking prick. Beats Siege. Way behind on schemes this century. Keep making great intricate plans to bring down whole planets or space marine chapters over the course of hundreds of years. They just end up getting eaten by tyrannids instead. No the other chaos gods are talking shit behind my back. Notice Imperium world getting Necron. They could probably deal with it but their leaders keep fucking each other over for no reason. Those preachy emperor ladies show up and start burning slanishy cultists. Lol perfect. Send message to Slanesh. Destabilize the world and got to blame your dudes for it. Just as planned bitch. MFWI didn't even do anything. Governor's War of Adorva. Shit daddy wakes me up by setting the room lights on max and yelling where I have been. Part iron all night. High on lohostics. Am a second some weird shit this high administrator geek broad. Head exploding dot eggs. Wake up with a sekelshiaki youngster bishop I laid last night. He looks like he is starting to cry, turns red and bumbles some stuff about him using the emperor's protection and shit. While my father yells at me and completely ignores him. Apparently some shit happened in the north, now daddy wants me to bring some of this Einquestion creeps to agree to his plans. What happens with the Einquestion stays in the Einquestion.gif. Get home, bishop boy sent me a ton of flowers and shit. Daddy is sniffing his special medicine agion. Some of this commissariat are shat shot my brother, some robots are fighting his forces and some of the bolter bitches are here because someone told them about how the orgies we hosted in our palace. Be Ekelshiaki youngster bishop. 
Went to tempt the flock last night, keeping an eye out for heresy. While watching for demons, I found an angel. It was love at first sight for both of us. So caught up in the moment basically fainted into my arms. As I held her, she said the world was spinning. So overwhelmed by emotion she cried out to the emperor for guidance, saying she had no idea what was going on, as she was obviously hysterical with emotion, decided to take her home. Though I had the best intentions, she pulled me into the bed with her. We made tender love, and it was more than I ever could have imagined. She introduced me to her father in the morning. Had to leave but sent flowers. Can't wait to see my angel again. I can already imagine our future together. May have to make some changes concerning my career trajectory, but I'm sure my future father-in-law can help. BLDAR FAG Get woke by a dream about human fags waking some robots. Well shit. Get 20 other elder fags in kinky armor and hightail it to the planet. Farseer tells me that bitches be woke. Human fags blowing shit up all around. Chaos getting burnt. Robots popping out of the ground. My face when I turn to the Farseer and tell her I think we got this. Cementus command. Get really really high on love for the emperor. Nudge my friend Steve with my elbow. Hey, check this shit out. Send the cattle to some backwater ice planet with no supplies, instructions, or assistance. Steve high fives me. Feel the emperor smiling upon me. Cutie inquisitor laughs at my practical joke. Feels good man jpeg. Freaking love being a segmentus command. Lads. Catachin idiots didn't even know what hit them ha ha. Be navy captain responsible for the transpiration of this shit show. Unload like a gorillion weenie puff junior guardsman. Thank the emperor they're off my fucking ship they're ruining everything. Watch on the voxcaster from the wardroom as they get eaten by those green robots. Nobody asks for orbital bombardment. Nobody gets orbital bombardment. Since Orium reports warping, or specs is identify an imperial gala field. Watch as those insufferable cunts cruise past. Fucking Lameo somebody's getting purged. Zoom in as the governor's palace is raised to the ground. Man being in the navy sure is great. Be farseer. Monkey interlopers are squatting on a Necron to tomb world. Spend three centuries cooking up a plan to trick the nearby orc empire into invading the tomb world. Waking the Necrons and wiping as many of the other out as possible. This'll show those elf bimbos who's the real master of Kikaku. After 298 years of artfully tricking the orcs into moving closer and closer, turn my attention elsewhere for a year to help some exodite rock bangers kill a nid splinter fleet. Cult of she who thirsts manages to infiltrate Dumbus human world. Hold Kokirji on top of the fucking overlord's tomb somehow. 300 years of careful orchestration ruined by some horny monkeys. Fuck the shit webway. Orcs will probably come before the ordained time and in insufficient numbers. Decide to plant prophetic dreams in the minds of the guardians to get them off their asses and go deal with this mess. Imitate their muscle grain speech patterns to give them further inspiration. One of the knuckle draggers says I think we got this. I had this 300 years ago you double monge. Be fighting and smashing. Zoggin god fun is what it is. Keep finding maps that have damn red circle fangs over the humi worlds. Still don't understand. Wizard circle gotta go fast. Tell the sneaky boys to see if they's got lots of fighters over here. Might be good for crumping. Sneaky boys come back. All the humies is dead. All the green mechs is dead. Just one of them knife is shaking a head and muttering something about buckle shaggers. Didn't know they loved deer belt so much. Try to stomp but humies start throwing dacker at the planet from space. Bloody cheats. The lesson, knobs, is never bother with maps. Be some boy underboss. We was finding maps to a good fight. Boss doesn't send us in fair a good wag. Send us dumb sneak gits. Tells us was already missed the crumb. How's do I smash my warbus and take his teeth? Be navy pilot. Cap orders me and the other guys to transport like 2 billion guardsmen. Transport M. Realize that giant ass palace is burning. Have a few drinks before getting back to work. Be canonous. Torching heretics goes really smoothly. These are pretty anemic heretics. Not sure how they overthrew a system government. Barely more than some ravers who think they'll get laid more if they pray to Slanesh. But whatever. Heresy is heresy and Prometheum is cheap. Inquisitor fucked off somewhere but he's auto Xenos so who cares. Not my department.jpg. Highest ranked Ekelshiaki rep I can find is this fucking kid. Literally half my age. Not sure how he got to be a bishop. Sweat to the emperor he hides a stiffy every time I talk to him. Saved some party slut from getting barbecued because she's his betrothed. Sure, why not. Now we can turn our attention to the Necrons. 
Fuck, was hoping to bounce before that. Athril Horta PNG. Guess the Emperor wills it, hope we don't get Sanctuary 101. No the guard is gonna expect us to do all the work because we have power armor and aren't retarded. Can't bombard everything because those fuckwits are still there. No even if we live a starts we'll probably show up and take all the credit. Get Meltigan. Get hair done. Get nice new ermine scarf because the other one got heretic ash on it. All ready to fight some death robots. My face when the elder and the orcs show up. The imperial citizen. Work 18 hours a day for the god emperor at my shitty job in the manufactorum. Pay is shit but my family needs the money. Too old to join the guard. Here there's a battle going on nearby but we have to keep working. The Emperor protects dot vox cast. Suddenly a squad of sisters of battle appears. Fear screaming about heretics. Hold up my hands and say I am not a heretic. They fucking torch me alive with their flamers. Witnesses are dead. Governor got torched by the Sororitas so that's one loose end tied up. Dota has her own shit to deal with. Navy in position as a backup. On my way out of this sector. Never have to carolus shit eating grin again. Fuck that smug. Milius bastard. Comms chime. Literally how? Nobody left in system to bother me. Entire planet's burning. It's some navy goon. Says orcs and elder have shown up. Now there's three fucking xenos. Can't leave system now. Can't take being in this system without a good squeeze. Looks like I'm gonna have to call a briefing with the naval contingent. Throne. I hope they've got some good skirt serving on that flying cathedral. E cabal member. Fucking true burns jpg. Fucking Chadbon tells me we have to re all space raid. Pretty sure they are all going to hog all the great weapons again. All I can do is pray they don't hang me off the edge of the raider again. Fucking pricks. Okay. Game face. Try my best to look cool, but hanging off the edge really make me nervous so I always end up just sort of hanging out on deck. Fuck these things need to be bigger so this planet has humans. Necrons. Fucking slana she fucks and those white bread elder fucks all fighting on it. Fight goes okay. Managed to accidentally shoot one of those fucking chadborns in the ass with my splinter rifle. They blame each other. Chadborns of course take as many elder pain slaves as possible. I get some sort of human female who screams a lot. Guess it's time for the pain train. I torture her and she's totally into it. Now I think I'm in love and the chatborn won't stop teasing me. Be me. Slana she heretic. Echol Shiaki calls us out. Starts torching base of operations while corpse of fact navy bombards the planet from orbit. Shaha thirst scud JPG. Freaking out. Managed to hide under conveyor belt in crowded manufactorum. See cannonus with flamer. Corpse worshipper old fag sees me under the belt. Starts to reveal hiding place. Gets torched along with a dozen normies. Turns out Manufactorum produces asbestos, so I get off scot-free. My bless Benes face when braze slanish jpg. Be road trader. Sleep through all this bullet after my week long bender. Be canonous. Planting melter bombs in Necron tomb with the gals. Sent all my repentious to die going in the other way as a distraction. Lost my other eye fighting a giant robot centipede. Batao.jpg. Shit's looking grim. Was really hoping to live out the rest of my milf years. Hand bolt pistol to Celestion. You must hold them back. Sister Bridget. Know that you die with honor in the god emperor's praise. Other sororitas start to tear up. Hear her chains ward revving as we escape. My face when I really just pick the cattiest bitch in the order. Whose scarf is a bit much now Bridget. Have fun getting flayed alive you dumb fucking cow. So I hope you guys enjoyed. This is one of my favorite 40k threads as I did say. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe and all that good shit to get the next part. Don't know how many parts this is going to be cut up into. But like, we'll just take it day by day and see what happens. Either way, hope you enjoyed. Also be sure to check out the links for merch. Got some nice looking t-shirt designs you guys will love. This, this is, is not okay. This needs to stop now. This is cancer. This, this is so much cancer that I can feel the tumors growing on my back. And it's way down heavy on me and it's not okay. Can you help a nigga out and just stop this? Please?